let's try and make wait what are we doing <laughs> let's try and make connor from i was gonna say deviant detroit unleashed what is that game detroit become human in the sims because you guys want me to try and give it a go i'm gonna do deviant connor and i'm gonna do um machine connor so we can compare both i think this is the most similar to his face so i'm gonna use that as like a starting block um oh my hairs are still broken though hmm the background is bright it's because i'm on the blue gen of not so berry let me just like see if um my i can like use any of the hairs that i actually want to use for him if we can't use the hairs then this might be a rip in the chart look how long my game takes to load it takes 12 and a half million years to load anything okay well that's basically his hair and that works so okay we can make him his, his hair's kind of like that right he has this little bit flicking down at the front okay um no i can't upload all the different detroit become human endings onto youtube because it's not my content we were just watching somebody else's content and reacting to it um so it's not my content yeah this hair's literally perfect um let me get um a little corner face up as well so we can do a little compare and contrast um connor detroit become this is not helping with stopping this game being my entire personality by the way i feel like this is making it worse um i need a really clear picture of just his face Ooh, expressionless which is quite good because he doesn't have expressions very often um but not fun art okay this is quite useful Why does his why does his clothes when he's like pretending to be human crack me up so much? I saw a meme where it was like like oh why can't I move things in my stupid streamlabs? It's so broken. It won't let me like shift things and move them. Like it's like locked. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh Quan, go smaller, please smaller yeah he does look like he's trying to be a rapper um yeah it won't let me like edit transform size um let me just try and make him smaller this way instead oh no what have i done <laughs> <laughs> that's still not right is it yeah, my Streamlabs is broken and won't let me, like, edit his face very well. That's about the right proportions, isn't it? Um, I saw someone say that in his, in his like, deviant form, like, on the right, he's like, um, meet your, I would like to meet your father. Then on the left, he's like, um, she calls me daddy too. <laughs> that just really cracked me up. Um... Wait, what did I just do to... Um, where can I move? I can't move him. It's driving me crazy. Like, can I like... <laughs> I didn't say it. Somebody else said it. Okay. I'm going to stick him at the bottom of the screen. Not that far. Connor, you're not behaving. There you are. Okay, there we go. I know. Oh, there's that stupid little line at the side. I, I like literally my mental capacity cannot handle that um <laughs> there we go okay we at least have him there um i might need to get a picture of him up and at least we know what we're going for now look it's just the same job done accomplished mission mission accomplished i don't know if to turn shaders off i never do that but i might have to because like yeah, this is more Detroit Become Human. Like, Detroit Become Human's not a happy little oversaturated mess. Um, Connor. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Connor. Android. That's what I would call him. <laughs> okay, and then... His eye colour is right, but his eye shape is wrong. Um, I don't think I'll get to use my cool eyes. Because I don't think they're his eyes, are they? Um, 
I gonna have to keep flicking. Like, let me just open this image in you, Chubb, so I can see it really big. Okay. And oh my gosh, technically, his pronouns... His pronouns are it. Because that's how he refers to himself. He doesn't call himself he. All androids are it. 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 It's. Well, that's really like, I, I, but that was really jarring in the game, especially when you started to see them as human. Um, it would like grilled cheese. <laughs> Does it change the as you hear? I made the grilled cheese. Wait, what? That burnt grilled cheese is it. It would like grilled cheese. Bob told it about the best grilled cheese recipe ever. Grilled cheese is its first love. <laughs> Yeah, the deviant one is he. His last name would be his model number. Actually, so true. There we go. Um, okay, for his his deviant one, then I will change his, his pronouns. Um, gosh, what kind of eyes does he have? Probably... Yeah, that's a good starting block. And then his face is wider, shorter. Eyes are definitely... He's got quite a big forehead. I say that as a fellow big foreheader. Um, I brought, I'm like doing really rough. This is how I have to start when I'm making a sim. And then I like go back over and do everything like properly. He's got quite sparse eyebrows. Um, and his eyebrows have like a softer angle. They are brown. His hair's a bit dark right now. Got like mousy hair, hasn't he? Like that. Maybe slightly darker actually. Yeah, like there. You love it when people make real people for, uh, from real life in The Sims 4. I hope I can do him justice and get him right. Right now he's not gonna look anything like it, but over time, I feel like we will we'll get there. You just need to be patient with me, give me time. Brown eyes, cause everyone knows brown eyes are the best eye color. Um, and then he actually has like this bit of his eye, like this little, like you see this like top bit here, sits over the edges of his eyes. However, I don't think you can do that in Sims very well. I also hate that it has this really strong black line. And I think the way you get that rid of that black line is weirdly enough in cheek, is it? Which part, which, how do you do that on the face? You can make it so these lines aren't as strong. Hmm, we might have to do a different eye shape. Okay, I... Okay, work with me here. I know it looks wrong right now, but it's got the heavy eyelids. So let me try working with this one for one sec. Because I think that's closer to his eye shape. I would absolutely hate to see somebody make me on The Sims. Because, like, you'll notice things about um, yourself that you otherwise wouldn't notice. I need to make this bit, like, more like that, I think. Like, if I show you what I'm looking at so you can, like, see what I mean. I look. And then you see this bit? His eyelids sit over his... His like upper eyelid sits on top of his eyelid. So yeah. Yeah, I think brown eyes are really soulful. I've just realized that he's not got dark brown eyes. He has like somewhere between brown and hazel. So yeah. Yeah, you start noticing a lot of detail, don't you? And I think sometimes it can be like a little bit like a little bit much, you know? Like nobody wants to see themselves in that level of detail. Um he has Wider lips, but they're not very... They are probably quite thinnish. And this is nice, Connor, so I'm going to give him, like, a slight smile. And then nose. I don't think he's... I don't think his brow looks like that. Man, I need to see him from the side. And his jaw is not so square. Can I soften his jaw a little? Oh gosh. We'll get there. 
more hooded yeah i think those eyes are a little bit closer don't forget we've not um he's got tiny ears man wow um we've not applied any skin details yet so <laughs> the daddy thing's cracking me up connor detroit side profile oh i've got some great side profiles here he, he does a lot of side profiling which is really handy so i'll show you guys again this right here right right, right here is what we're going for see this is what look i told you i like a hunter brow actually ali's brow looks just like that and then nose a slight tiny bump in the middle but not very much and then quite like shapely nostrils <laughs> try the god skin on him he's gonna look a lot better i i don't have a widow's peak hairstyle no i don't think i do you think he looks like tom holland from the side right we've got a lot of work to do with this side profile in fact i'm gonna take his hair off for now yeah this side this side profile currently is nothing like it so this bit's flat like that but then this bit comes out can i like can i do much no you can't shape the brow much here like i want to do it like more in and out like that you know but i don't think you can now that's as flat as it goes okay eyes are closer to his brow and higher up like so yeah that looks better and then nose i think i'm actually gonna just apply a different nose i'm gonna see if no that one's not right at all okay that's a better start pull these right down though Sorry if I go quiet while I'm making a sim. <laughs> um, I need to like change his nose angle a lot. I think his cheeks are wrong as well. I think that's what's freaking me out. Like his cheeks are wrong. Okay, we've got the slight bump. But then I need to... His, his nose at the end kind of does that more. So like bump and then a little bit flatter maybe. That's quite close, right? Yeah, he his cheekbones don't come forward and he doesn't have this line here. So the cheeks currently are wrong. Um he also has a very soft like you see how this is like sharp? This is very round. So let's find some yeah. See how this is just like rounder from the side? He's got quite low cheekbones, I would say. Which probably gives him like a softer appearance. I think this part of his eye is like too, um... Let's try bringing this bit up a little bit. It's annoying because I want... I wish you could do more detail edits. Like I want to keep this bit like this, but that bit I want to like shave off that bit. You just can't like edit as much as you want to be able to... You can see a pre cheekbone pretty um, prominent. True, but his cheekbones are like here, I would say, rather than like, you know, like a high cheekbone. Yeah, his nose is wider. I've not finished his nose yet. Um, he's not got like, you know, like an elf cheekbone is like really high. I don't like, this nose looks right from the side, but I don't like the... Um... I don't like the nostrils. There's not enough like definition to the nostrils. Let me put him back at his side profile again so I can finish that off because I've not finished this bit. Okay, this bit's longer, which means his mouth's a little bit lower. And then his chin is smaller and more like this. And then his top lip is actually bigger, believe it or not. Okay. <laughs> I find noses so awkward on this game. 
Like I absolutely hate doing noses. This section of the nose. I hate doing it. This is still wrong. Look how forward his cheekbone is. It's still wrong. But this is what we're trying to go for. Yeah, noses are hard. Like that's just way more angular and strong and like more youthful. But it's not like showing so much on here. I need to get like his, uh, his, his whole face is, needs to be a bit longer actually. I've made it a bit squishy. I get him at the same angle. What is it that's wrong? It's his cheek, isn't it? I also think I've now made his nose a little bit too big. I'm just gonna. Yeah, that's better. Um, I need to sort his cheekbone out. Let me see the cheeks from the side. I think that's gonna help me. Okay, Lexi, I'll let you out. Give me one sec. Oh, wait, what was that one? Hmm. Let me just let Lexi do brush out. Give me one sec. She always is barking. Make the chin smaller. Yeah, you're right. Sometimes when you make the face longer, yeah, he's got quite a little chin, actually. When you make the face longer, it, it does too much of the lower face rather than like the mid face. I wish I could pull his eyes forward more. I also think when I change his body type, that's going to change his face a little bit too. You know who he looks like? I have basically accidentally made the driver from a handmaiden's tail, which I did not mean to do. <laughs> his eyes are quite deep set. Okay, we're on the right lines. We're on the right lines. I need to get his um his cheeks right though. His cheeks are really bothering me. Cheeks are like wait, I've not even tried dragging them, have I? I need to pull them. It's this bit here. These little folds he doesn't have. Which means something around here is wrong. I can't figure out what. Hmm. Maybe when you apply some skin details, it's going to help. You feel like his nose shape's wrong? I think his nose is a bit sharper at the end than what we've done. I think it's kind of wider at the top, but then it ends a little bit sharper. Mm, it's hard, man. This is why this is why I like making people. No, his nose is soft at the end, actually. Um, making people is hard. Yeah, I might I might go for like um a sim nose shape and change it rather than trying to go for a custom one. Like if we try like I'm gonna have to make that stupid bump again, aren't I? Right, bear with me. <laughs> that might be more close to it. Yeah, that feels closer now. His mouth is higher, more closer to his nose, and it's kind of frowned. He looks a bit sad in this picture, doesn't he? I also think his eyebrows curve around his face a little bit more. But I find eyebrows very hard to mess with. I have an extra slider here. I'm just trying to grab it. It's like a CC one that lets me change eyebrow thickness, but it's not very easy to grab. <laughs> As you guys can probably tell. Particularly on like smaller brows. He's kind of looking a bit mad right now. Yeah, his lips are like, like not as cupid-y, I guess. A bit more like this. 
And a bit like slimmer in the middle. Man, eyebrows are so hard. Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? I w Why can't you pull eyebrow eyes down further? I hate that it does that. I'm gonna put skin details on him and just see if it helps. Yeah, he does have soft downturn brows. I might change those brows. It's not letting me grab. I've got a, br a filter, um, a slider that makes brows bigger. But it's it's literally every time I try and grab it, it's grabbing like his actual brow bone instead. And that's making things really hard. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps doing that. It's annoying. It's annoying the crap out of me. Oh, it broke in the update. Well, I did use it in wolves this morning, but I used it on a wolf. So I don't, I don't know. Also, I've just realized I've not even tried to do his skin tone, which is a little bit, uh, we're not miles off. I think his skin tone is maybe just a little bit, I think it's paler than this. Problem is the skin tones in this game are a little bit odd. I find it really hard to like get the skin tone you're after. You think it's more pink? Yeah, you're right. I'm doing it to um What what is this? Why are we in a club? There we go. Okay, we'll try this for now. And then I'm just gonna throw some skin details on him because I feel like that instantly makes things look realer and that's gonna help us. I can't, there's something wrong here. I know what's wrong. Wait. Right, let's start checking some skin details on and see what we can do. That one's not actually not too bad. It kind of works because he doesn't have strong eyelids. Uh, that one does not look good. We're going for more realism. Uh, you guys want me to try the god skin? I think this one's okay as well, but it's not. It's not right. Um, god skin is this one. Holy eyelids are wrong, but that that skin is good because he has freckles. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah, that's that's actually quite good. If I made his eyes, you know, I have a real issue with making eyes too big. Um, mouth is a little bit too wide as well. And chin is definitely too big. See, I mean, once you add the actual, um, oops. Once you add skin details, it's sometimes it's easier to see the mistakes. I don't think his chin's as curvy either. I think he's got quite a straight chin. And his chin's further forward. Well, that's not good. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. He has four headlines, true, but I don't know if I'm going to get enough, like enough layers for that let me add some lashes those android lashes very important he doesn't have very uh, i wish there was like a lesser lash yeah something like that's good he's not got strong lashes just a little bit okay i'm actually quite excited now i feel like suddenly he just started looking a lot more like him he's got a very round head it's like but if i do this you know what I need to do? I need to pull down this specific part there, but not make his chin bigger, which is harder than it looks. Because he, he's quite wide here. Got a very round head. Smaller ears. They're as small as they go. <laughs> he's got really tiny ears, hasn't he? Yeah, that's as small as they will go. I can't get them any smaller. Sims doesn't actually go as small. Got a light change to purple, of course. Um, 
There we go. Purple lights. Make the bottom of his chin flatter. I'm trying to bring his chin up without changing this line. But I can't, I can't bring it up anymore. Also, uh, his chin needs to be forward a little bit. Oh, his nose is too big now. Oh, this is good! Too much smile. Oh, I can't pull his nose down anymore. I'm getting screwed over by like stupid sim physics because his chin's way too big, but I can't pull his nose down. I can only pull his, his mouth down. I wish the sliders let you do more. I need to like slim out this part of him a little bit. I think he's looking good. Maybe his lips are a tiny bit bigger. Let me go to the close picture again. His lips are like much more like this kind of shape. Yeah, his lips are more like that shape. Oh, this is quite cool, right? This is looking quite cool. Okay. Um, he does have under eye bugs. I don't know why you'd bother giving that to... Uh, I, I started calling him Cylon in my head again then. I don't know why you'd give that to a Cylon. But he does have like under eye bugs. So I'm going to add those. Again, it just adds a little bit more realism. Let's try those ones for now. Although I think there's a better eyelid. However, I think it's here. I think it's on the same layer as his skin. Oh no, it's on the same layer as his eyelashes actually. I might be able to get away with... Oh no, no, no. It puts too much above. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, I'm pretty happy with this, guys. He has a very grey tone. True, but also don't forget it's the game lighting. His eyebrows aren't straight, but I've fully fallen out with his eyebrows. I'm going to go back to them. Um... No. Get off. <laughs> Get off! I've done eyelids on that layer, so I can't do anything else on that layer. I know it looks like I'm making him really tired, but it's just because um, Detroit is like a much more realistic game. So, and people tend to have a lot of shadow around their eyes, but Sims don't. So I'm going to add a little bit more there. I'm going to change his uh, eye color as well. I don't feel like it's quite right. Um, I need to add some like moles to him too. No. None of that. His burden of empathy makes him tired. I've got to admit by the end of the game. Yeah, you're right. His head is a bit long. I still wasn't really sure whether he was actually feeling emotion and empathy or whether he was still just doing what he thought, like replicating it. I felt like that about all of them. Like I still couldn't really tell whether it was real or not. Wow, he looks really tired now. <laughs> oh geez, poor guy. He's really been stressed since this whole robot rebellion. <laughs> Oh no, it's stuck on him. Get off. Oh my gosh, it's stuck on him. Oh my gosh, I can't take it off. No, why is it stuck on him? I can't get it off. Yeah, his top lip is a bit wide. I think I'll change that. Um, I can't get... <laughs> I can't get it off. I'm gonna have to just go backwards. I can't get it off. <laughs> It's trapped on him. It's still there, isn't it? Okay, there we go. Jeez, I thought we were trapped forever then. What game is he from? He's from Detroit Become Human. Uh, we just finished it and it's going to be our entire personality going forwards for at least 
I don't know, maybe another week or two. So um this kind of makes his gray skin tone, right? Um, so obviously I need to just continue to be obsessed with it. Um I really wish I had a widow's peak. Unfortunately, I don't. I don't know if I've made him a bit too gray. What do you reckon? Hmm. Okay, nose mask. I think <clears throat> I've done him a little bit too... There we go. Is he a bit too gray? What do you reckon? Well, let me find the nose mask that gives him like really sharp nose edges. That one's quite good. Yeah, I think I've made him a little bit too dead looking. I know he's an android and his blood is blue, but I don't know. I feel like they're all a bit much. I also don't like the shine at the end of his nose. So anything that kind of takes that off a bit, I think is good. Maybe something like that. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of the gray, guys. I'm just not a big fan. I'm just going to go for white instead. That's better. You've been obsessed with Connor ever since the game came out. Understandable, to be honest. Um, is this like little... Okay. Right. Where are his freckles and stuff? Okay. He's got like cheeky kind of ones. He does have these lines on his head. I wonder why you would give those to an android. I'm not sure. Yeah, he's, I've done his top lip a bit big. And his nose goes down quite a lot in the middle. So I need to try that too. Okay. Misha, thank you so much for the 24 months in a row. Let me get you the flowers. For some reason, I decided to put them underneath the quarry box. Thank you so much. Hope you are well as well. Cassie Nicole, also thank you so much for 13 months in a row. Nola Cola, thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much for the 20 months in a row. You're actually from Detroit. That's so cool. Did you see anything you recognize from Detroit? Let me know. Uh, Kimmy Bob, thank you so much for 21 months in a row. And Meek's artwork has subscribed. Can we welcome them to the beaches, please? Yeah, um, his, his nose is wrong, right? It's more like that. I think that's better. Um, right, I don't think I'm going to be able to get the freckles perfect. These are too strong. I need like a mole overlay that's like random moles everywhere. No. I will be doing a lip overlay later as well. So um, don't worry if they don't look quite look right. <laughs> Not the eye bags again. These ones are a little bit better. I just can't get the right color. They're all a little bit too um, undersaturated. It does look way more real with them though. You and Connor have similar noses. I, he's got a nice nose, I think. Nah, they, these, these eye bags are cool, but maybe that one? I just think it, it's, it's too much. It's a little bit too heavy on him. Yeah, I think his lip shape's wrong as well. I'm just gonna go back to my bed. Give me the thing. Oh, look at Evie. Everyone, look at her. Wait, can they see Evie for a second? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me switch to bean cum. Give look, me one sec. Look, look. Oh, oh the look. baby. Come back to your bean so cutely. Oh, <laughs> baby. Oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Lexi so, gets real jealous. Uh, disrupting the streamy. Yes, dancey, dancey, dancey. Do you remember when my legs kept on being in tree? Yeah. <laughs> Your knees look really red for some reason. My, I think my saturation's a little bit look high. At my, uh, look, look at the contrast. Yeah. Non tan, tan. But you look red on camera, but you look brown in real life. I need to sort my camera settings out. Come on, girls, leave me alone. <laughs> there we go. Right. Yeah, because I look really saturated as well. I only just realized that. <laughs> he's not sunburned. He's out in real life, he's actually just brown. But for some reason, um, 
my camera just really likes saturation. This is good actually, because I'll be able to give him like um I'll be able to give him like a stubble and see how we'd look with stubble. <laughs> I like I need facial hair on a man, you know? I like a bit of facial hair on a man. I don't know what his his eye corners go to about mid eye, his face eye corners, his mouth corners, <laughs> and around. Yeah, I'm I'm having a lot of issues with the jaw because the game won't let me do what I want to do. More mouth corners. Yeah, I want his chin to be smaller, but when I do that, it won't let me pull the nose down, and it's 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 literally driving me crazy. And it's just like his side. Pro Why is his chin not look sharp from the side? Just let me pull the nose down more. Oh, I need a slider that lets you change your nose down more. Posture check, thank you. More frowny. Lips are a bit wide now, I think. I'm never going to be happy with the lips, I think, because. I don't want the cupid's bow, so I want it wider, but I want it to go in more here. And just like none of them are doing it. And it's really making me angry. Okay. His chin looks too small from his side profile to me. Like if you look at his side profile here, his chin's bigger and it comes out more. So let me try and do that. I know there's absolutely no need to like go this deep. But yeah, so I think that's quite a good side profile now. I think he's bumped slightly higher up his nose. Like here. Okay. I think I've turned his chin a little bit too far forward. Right, but... I think his bottom lip's too big. Right, look at this, look at the side profile comparison. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's just my game. <laughs> look. It's, we're not there yet, but I think we're a lot closer than we were. We're getting there, aren't we? The weird thing is, on the game, like, it looks like his side profile, sh his chin should be longer. But when I try and give him a longer chin, it just doesn't look right. I don't know. Looks better, right? His bottom eyelids are smaller. What do you mean by smaller? Why is it not letting me do like what I want to do to his eyebrows? He's dancing, but just with his eyebrows. Do you remember that advert, that Cadbury's advert, where the kids with the eyebrows and they were like doing all this business? Ow. <laughs> I don't know why, but it just reminded me of it then and it kind of cracked me up. I want him to look, this is, this is Deviant Connor. So I want to try and make him look a bit softer, but it won't let me. Oh, look, that's maximum softness. Maybe that's better. He looks a bit softer now, right? His lips go more in. Oh, I see what you mean. Like this. Yeah, that looks better. Give him a little smile. Well, you guys are saying make him frowny, yeah? Let me just try adding a few levels here. A few layers here. I really need... Um, I was going to try some different eyelids as well just to see if any of them look better. Um, I really need like some good mole overlays that don't sit on the same level as skin details. Oh my gosh, look how badass these eyes are. Oh, it's eyeliner. I thought it was the, the middle bit. Um... Look at 
kind of like just a little bit of that just to like add a bit of shading to the outside of his eyes. Try and make his cheeks chubbier. That's this bit. Oh, it won't let me. Okay, a bit more like that. Yeah, I think you're right. Well done, well done, well done. Um, let me see if there's any cool eyelid overlays because we do love an eyelid overlay. No, too much top eyelid. I, I like this. Sometimes like Sims is helpful for this and video games because... I have really like my top eyelids aren't big and it's really annoying for makeup. I can never like make them look nice. And then I will like see someone in a video game who I think looks really cool and they'll also ha not have much top eyelid. And I it's like really reassuring. Like it's like, oh, no, I do like that feature. I'm just being cruel on myself, you know? Maybe pull his under eyelid higher. Like this bit. I can't. I'm at maximum. I can only go down. He looks like he's communicating with the mother if I do that. Maybe if I pull his eye down, it will give the impression. There we go. If I pull his eye down, it gives the impression that his eyes are sitting a bit lower. Oh, I'm impressed with this. I'm quite happy with that. He looks looking good, right? I, I've not lost it yet, guys. <laughs> I've not lost my touch when it comes to making Sims. Um, these are probably my most realistic lips. What kind of lips do you have, Connor? you dead lips there, apparently. Oh, your lips aren't chopped at all. You're an android. Why would your lips be chopped? Okay, we'll go for these ones then. Probably there. Okay, and then does it look better with them or without them? I think with. Yeah, the hair's gonna put, I know he's got forehead wrinkles, but I don't have a layer to put it on. Um, I've run out of layers on my skin details because the forehead wrinkles are like here, but it would take all of his skin details off. So I really want to give him forehead wrinkles, but I can't, I just can't do it. His lips are a bit too wide. Yeah, I think you're right. I, they should go to where his pupils are. He looks kind of scared. <laughs> Nose is a bit smaller, okay. It would make sense to make all the androids are attractive in the game. They're all pretty. But especially if you're an android that needs to interrogate humans, humans have a bias towards attraction. So humans will always favor um, people that they think are pretty. It sucks, but it's, it's a natural bias we all have. So we find people with pretty faces more entertaining, more interesting, more trustworthy. Um... So I think the fact that they're all, all the androids are attractive makes total sense. Yes, this is what we were waiting for, guys. He does need a little chin dent, doesn't he? Oh, oh, this is kind of a mirror image of where his actual freckle is. We don't know what his body looks like. I've just realized. Oh, I love, I love like freckles and moles so much um he's this body type is not right at all though he's kind of slim but shapely that's how i would describe him so probably like that i would say that's his body type do anders have body hair huh. oh i can add it on tattoos let me see if i can find that um I don't think he has any scars, does he? Why would he have scars? Where is body, uh, sorry, headlines? Yeah, I give so many Sims freckles. Ali has freckles, but I don't. I get moles instead of freckles. Uh, I might give him scleras because they make your eyes a little bit more realistic. 
Because that people's eyes <sighs> aren't like really um like so that's with. Oh mind you, these eyes are nah, these eyes are actually quite good for natural shading. I'll leave it off. They were fawn legs. Um what was it in? Where were the fawn legs? Was it under bodies? I was trying to download CC ahead of werewolves going Ooh. out, which was like, um, hmm. what can I make a, yeah, look. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, can I make a werewolf without actually having the werewolf pack? I think that's his body type. He was very slim, wasn't he? He needs sunken eye lines next to his nose. What, like here? I don't know if I have anything that does that. I was trying to add stuff that did it, but nothing was right, quite right. Yeah, I still want to do it because not everyone has bought the new pack. Um, but I still want them to like see like that they can make a werewolf themselves if they wanted. So that's kind of where it came from. Yeah, I don't have anything that does those lines. I don't think. I think the closest I've got is probably. Um, where is the contour? There's like a face contour, a male face contour, but I can't find it. The freckles look way better though. I'm assuming if he's got freckles on his face, he's going to have them on his body. So I'm going to keep those. Um, right, I said I wasn't happy with his eye colour, didn't I? But let me just do that for now. I know that looks absolutely terrifying, but it's so that I can um, apply makeup over his eyes. Why do I feel like I'm not fully zoomed in? Oh, I am. Okay, so his eye colour is this. So I thought his eyes were really dark brown, but they're, they're not. Like, his eyes aren't like... They're actually more like dark hazel. I think so. There's a mod that lets... Yeah, I've seen the Skyrim Werewolf mod. Yeah, his eyes are hazel to me. They're not like um, like chocolate brown. They're more like hazel. So like... Closer to that, but I'm not saying we go for that one specifically. Oh, that's good. There. Ooh, that's good. That's pretty similar. I think his eyes are closer together. Like there. What do you reckon? So it's that or the originals, which would be these ones. I think they're better. Yeah, he does have a puppy dog kind of look. He is very pretty. He is very pretty. Do I have the android eyes? I think I still do. I also have dragon eyes. Just for reasons. Um, the android eyes are here. Oh gosh. <laughs> That's kind of creepy, right? These ones are cool because they move. Why do his eyes feel like they're a little bit too close together? I don't know. Oh. Obscurus did a CC collection on Connor? You are kidding me. So I could have got the exact right ones. No way. Yeah, if they had those eyes, they wouldn't be trusted at all. Humans place a lot of, um, like... Emphasis on eyes. This is good. You see what would be even better? Chef's kiss. That. Or even just that. No, no, not chops. Not chops. Chef's kiss. <laughs> But he doesn't have one, so we won't do it. Right. 
Um, oh yeah, I was gonna do cheeks and see if I could get any eye bugs on cheeks instead. Oh yes, it's this. I don't know what, you never see his body. I, I, in my head, he's not super muscular and strong because I think Android strength would not have to be from human muscle. It would just be from the way they're built. But he is pretty strong. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, we're gonna start the quarry next week, Snail Lady. Um, let me try him with these siren eyes because they are my favorite eyes. Probably not the right color though. Oh, there's a reason I love these eyes so freaking much. Oh, which one? Those or those? Siren eyes are so soulful. I think that's what it is. Yeah, Marcus is definitely ripped. He's got massive shoulders. I love siren eyes. Like, I just love them. I'm gonna make his eyes very slightly bigger. Just because I feel like small eyes in The Sims doesn't suit these Sims aesthetic as well. I don't know why. And I'm gonna also extend this part of his eye just very slightly. Claire babes, what fluffy, what? What? What are you saying? What? <laughs> Um, oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. We can use this to emphasize those lines that he's got here. It's getting a bit of pixelation. Yeah. What do you reckon? Yay or nay? Yay or nay? Wait, which, what did I click on to get that? Oh God, <laughs> why is it selecting three layers? What the hell? Wait, where did that just go? What did I click on for that? Why Why have I have no, no idea how to play this game? Oh, that one. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know if I like it more what, with, with or without. It looks more human with, right? I think with he does he is very shiny but humans are quite shiny like look how shiny i am right now <laughs> he's not human though or i can just use this to get a bit of cheekbone emphasis like this but I, he's not got sharp cheekbones so i don't know if it makes any sense i think under eye look maybe better what do you reckon I think it looks quite cool as well. I'll turn it down a bit. I'll get it because I want his freckles to show through. We'll do it to like here. Okay. Um, should I give him any eye flex? Does he have any eye flex? He does have a little eye flex. Just like a little bit like that, I think is quite good. And then... Maybe just like that, not too much, just a little bit to give him that edge. Yeah, it looks very realistic, doesn't it? You should make them then download the Connor set by Obscurus. Let me find the Connor set. Obscurus Connor set. Um, oh wow, his looks really different to mine. Oh my gosh, I'll be able to get the clothes though. Oh, it comes with a hairline. His corner looks so different to mine. Okay, I'm gonna download it just to have in the background. Let me show you guys. Sorry, I just realized I didn't show you guys. This is what it looks like. I'm glad I'm not the only one that thought to do this because I'm getting a bit worried about the levels of obsession I've got with this game now. But it has like his moles. So, and it also has his nose preset. I don't think that looks like him though. 
I'm gonna be honest, I think his cheekbones are much like I don't know. I don't think that looks as, as similar to him. It looks really good, but it looks like um a very sharp cheekbone. Whereas we know he's got quite a wide face. Oh, it's hard to tell. Some parts of it are obviously way better. Like the chin and the lips are a lot better. Hmm. To be fair, they might not have spent 12,000 years on it like I did. <laughs> See, I think, that, I think that looks a bit more like the game, the in-game one. Yeah, the front profile's good. But I think the chin is better than mine. Hairline I actually need. Okay, so the hair I was thinking was this one. But I really need a widow's peak. I need that dip. I don't think I have a widow's peak. Yeah, there's definitely some parts they did better. I do have a beanie. Uh, I'm just going to check there's not like another hair that's slightly better. If not, we'll go for this one. Yeah, my hairs are still broken. Boo! But actually, where did he get the rig out from? I need Connor's rig out. Did he say where he got his rig out from? Um, Detroit Connor Sims for outfit. Sorry, that's my foot on the chair. Don't worry, guys. Um, no, not the RK900. We hate that. Okay, I've got the suit jacket as well. We're laughing, gang. Cyberlife suit jacket. Right. They won't show until I restart the game, which is a bit annoying, but we'll get as far as we can, then we'll restart and check it out. I'll find mods. My mods folder is disgustingly big now. Oh. I've downloaded Connor wrong. That needs to go in my tray files. Sorry, guys. Do you think his hair's a bit darker? I think you could be right. Without the Widow's Peak, it looks nothing like him. It's really weird. Let me just stick this in my tray. And then I have to download all these bits of individually. There we go. Oh, it's even got a cheek preset. Nice. All right, let's download all these. Boop, boop, boop. Does anyone else like feel, sometimes feel like the Sims, um, that like the Sims, re not the Sims resource, the Sims file share, like just blocks them? Cause it's like, why are you downloading so much stuff? You need to go away. I feel like it does that to me all the time. Yeah, Widow's Peak's really important. A chin dimple. Do I have to get a chin preset with one? He's not got a really deep dimple, I wouldn't say. Actually, on this, he doesn't have a dimple at all. Hmm. Look. He doesn't have a dimple. What about on his daddy version? Oops. No. It looks like he shaved that morning. He's got such sad, sad eyes. Um, I think the eyebrows are wrong. We don't be looking all happy. We don't do that here. Uh, um, I think his eyebrows might be better with these ones. <laughs> what? <laughs> right, if I can fix these eyebrows... <laughs> Why are you Spock? Oh, babes, what's wrong? Oh, you hate your new eyebrows. You hate them so much. No, I can't. <laughs> I can't get his eyebrows to look right now. Nah, these eyebrows won't go low enough down. Look, I'm trying to drag them. 
I can't get them any lower. We're going to have to go back to the other one. Mistakes have been made. It sucks because those hairs are better. I find eyebrows so awkward on this game. He looks really sad though. We're just going to have to stick with these ones. I also don't think his eyebrows are the right shade of brown. I think they're better off like here. Yeah, I like those ones too. They look way better. Um, but they won't go low enough, which is really annoying. Okay, any hairs with like just the one flick going down at the front? That's a Widow's Peak. Problem is, would nobody makes Widow's Peak hairstyles. Look, nobody's got Widow's Peak hair. All of these are the exact same hairline. Where is the Widow's... That's annoying, isn't it? Why are only certain colours broken? Like, that one's fine. Weird, right? There's a wings hair I have. These are wings. Too shaved on the sides, though. It's not professional enough for cyber life. You have a Widow's Peak and you hate it? Why? Widow's Peaks are cool. Cool, Connor. Oh my gosh, no. Oh, why did it have to break hairs? That works too. Oh, I don't know between those two hairs now. We need the Widow's Peak preset. I've got it downloaded. I just need to restart my game. It's either that or that. I'm kind of feeling like this one now. Hmm. Right, let me just save where we've got him to. Oh, I need to give him some traits. Um, okay, well, he's an android, so he's technically a genius just because he can access the internet through his mind, which is massive Grenier. cheats. Um, he's also, I mean, he's probably lactose intolerant, let's face it. What else is he? Gosh, I don't know. What, what's, what do you assign a, a robot? Yeah, I think perfectionist is fair. Ooh, auntie. You think a, go a goofball? That's quite funny, actually. He's doing some poses for you. Goofball could kind of work because um, he does that little like dorky wink thing. How is he lactose intolerant? Because he can't eat. That's exactly why he's lactose intolerant. I feel like if he tried to eat, something would go really badly. And I mean, technically he is supernatural, but not in that way. Um, what do you, I didn't, I literally didn't even know that was a thing. What does he want to be? Huh. I don't know. Live, love, Connor. <laughs> Ooh. This is deviant. I think if I'd learned that I had emotions. I don't know. You couldn't ever have a family because they can't procreate. I don't even think he would have anything going on here. He likes dogs. He does like dogs. Villainous Valentine for the lols. I don't have an awkward trait. That would be actually kind of perfect. You know what? I might get rid of Genius and replace it with Dog Lover. Because that's the one of the only things we actually know about him that seems to be something that he preferenced. Because <laughs> he likes sumo, doesn't he? Yeah, neighborhood confidant could be a good one. Be a positive influence. That's nice. You think highly of him. That's sweet. Um. Okay, let me pick up my central 
It's not my central heat, my aircon. It's too cold in here. I'm freezing my butt off. Um, and I'm just gonna restart my game so I get all of those extra goodies. Um, we will put clothes on him. <laughs> I'm not leaving him like this. Um, it's just because I need his outfit. He was leader of the park, but he also wasn't. Because if he's leader of the park, he has to shoot himself in the head. So technically he's not leader of the park. He can't be. He can't be. I don't think he is a loner. I think he seeks out companionship with Hunk. Kimmy Bob, thank you so much for the one, two, three, four hundred bits. Appreciate that. And Friggy, thank you so much for the two months in a row. Zoe, thank you so much for the 10 months in a row. Double high fives to you. Windborne Traveler, thank you so much also for the 22 months in a row. And Misha, did I get your... I think I got your 24 months, but you can have some more flowers because why not? Yeah, leader of the pack is very Marcus. I think Marcus would be much harder to make as well. Probably because I've not, <laughs> not stared at his face so much. <laughs> Yeah, I uh, secretly wants to be loved. I think he just secretly wants companionship, like friendship. B, thank you for the posture check. You're right, my knee is on my chair, which is never good. Outgoing? Yeah, I guess he's quite outgoing. You could not get me to walk into that police uh, office as like the only android and be like, hello. <laughs> I would be like, no way, I'm not walking into that room. Too scary. Mm. Oh, we've got a blue light change for cyber life. There we go. Some blue lighties. And let's continue making him. He just wants Fend. He does want Fend. He is very enthusiastic about wanting to kill his own kind. That is fair. Um, this is a cool white screen. What's all this about? Sims or oh, Shams. There we go. Harsh goes me, huh? Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Oh. So that was my Connor. But I also got a tray file for a Connor. Let me see if I can find that. Where is Connor? Wouldn't it be at the top? Oh, he never joined. I added him to my tray file. That's really weird. Hmm. Twenty four. Yeah, I added him to the tray file. He's not there. I went by him. Oh my gosh! Sorry, guys. Am I actually that dumb? Mm hmm. Oh, here he is. Okay, so this is the Obscurus one. So let's pop that one in as well. And then let me finish dressing my Connor. Hmm. Oh no, where did his rig out go? Oh my gosh, why is mine so orange? Oh, I've got shaders on. There. Um, Let me put his little rig out on. My Sims kid's name is Connor. I love the name Connor. I love Irish names and Connor is like <laughs> such a beautiful name. I really like that. Um, huh. Tell me if you guys see it because I just, oh, there we go. Okay, there we go. And then some trousers. You know what I actually, <laughs> I actually realized he was wearing? I look sick. What do you mean I look sick? But I look sick, Jane. Um, I realized when he when I realized he was wearing jeans, it gave me the ick a little bit because it was jeans with a suit jacket, and it just gave me the ick. You know when like you can't like there's just something that it just it gives you the ick and you can't help it and you know that it's like unreasonable and unfair, but it gives you the ick anyway. That's what happened to me. So I might replace it with suit trousers. Yeah, he wears jeans. Ooh. Yeah, he's wearing jeans. Like, yeah, he didn't dress himself to be fair. But yeah, if I find you, um, Connor clothes, Detroit. 
He's his bottom half of his outfit is is jeans and it's does give you the ick, I'm afraid. Let me see if I can get close enough. Yeah, I mean this is like a cosplay of it and like it's jeans. Like you can tell a bit there actually. But yeah, they're jeans. I have two monitors, avocado. Yeah, ick, ick, ick. I know, I agree. Thank I'm so glad you guys said that as well. I have a lot of like unreasonable icks. Hmm. The other one is when men cross their legs. I just really hate it. And I like, I know it's just, it's just so nonsense. And like, let's just give them these. Um, So unfair, but I, I hate cross legs. I just it just gives me the ick and I can't help it. I don't know why, but it does. Um, I never looked at what shoes he had. Okay, just black shoes. Yeah, I just like cross legged. Yeah, fluffy. I don't know why. It's just I just it gives me the ick. Okay, those trousers are not long enough. <laughs> oh, this is what is actually gone. Freaking jeans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's a weird right but i don't think you control them i think it's just like it's either like how you were socialized or just your like individual attraction you know i think it looks better with a belt i think that's pretty good yeah, like not if they like put their uncle on the if they like do that, that's fine. Like you know, like that. But if they do it like that, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't. I don't know why, but it just like, <laughs> it just like, but <laughs> I would never tell someone that. Don't worry. Um, but it aches me all the same. Okay, I'm gonna put the same rig out on him so we can do a compare and contrast. Also realizing this guy's lost his hair somehow. Don't know where his hair's gone. <sighs> He's also got some big ass shoes on. Hmm. You don't like splayed legs. Now see, I think when when like wide legs when they let lean on them. I don't know, I like that. <laughs> <sighs> Should I just rep in the Gucci? Let's just get him rep in the bit of Gooch. Oh, I'm gonna give him the same one. Okay, you've lost your hair. So this is the Obscurus, Connor. How, how have you made the ears that tiny? Like, I the eyebrows are really good, to be fair. But I don't, I actually think I like my face more. Oh, his hair was clay. Uh... Let me give him the same hair. So I think the hair shade's really hard to get right. I think it's like here. So that's the Obscurus one. They've also given him Genius, which I originally gave him. And they've given him Soulmate. I don't know if he's capable of love, so I don't know if that works. So that's the Obscurus. And then this is mine. He looks, very, he looks like a Claire Sim, doesn't he? He definitely looks like a Claire Sim. I don't think either of us have quite captured him right. But I also just don't think it's easy to make humans in The Sims and catch that like essence of humanity. Um, I really want to give him stubble. <laughs> I can't help it, guys. What about just really light, like five o'clock shadow? Yeah, okay. I actually think he does have that. I think he na he does have a bit of five o'clock shadow. Uh, look. Look at this. Here. And like this. Connor's jawline's rounder. Yeah, he could be right there. Um, How can I do this right? And that's pretty good. 
His skin tone is wrong. To be fair, on my screen, he actually looks a little bit lighter than he does on your guys' screen. Um, let me show you. You're not getting it. Like, it's so weird. It's, it's because my screens have slightly different color set up. Hey, you guys are losing a little bit of the detail, actually. Let me do this. Just for this one. Um, and let me try changing his skin tone out a bit. I just, I really don't get on with skin tones in The Sims. I just like, I find them like so hard to um, get right. God, he looks sick as a pig. Do pigs look sick? I don't know. They do apparently now. None of these skin, like, why is there not like a pale pink based skin tone? They're all so saturated. Try neutral. Looks a bit dead. Okay, that's, that's not bad. Changes. Oh yeah. Okay. Right. Let me find out where is um widow's peak is. Connor skin. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like the Connor skin. What do you reckon? What's going on here? I don't like it. No, I don't like it. It's wrong that his mouth parts are wrong. I don't like his mouth. I like my version better. Okay, but let me find the other bits that came with it. Um, okay, tell me if you see Connor's face again. I know we've listened to this song like three times today, but honestly, for the last like 12 years, I've not been able to get enough of this song. Uh, I can't see any more Connor presets. Weird. Um, What else would they be under? I definitely added everything, I think. <laughs> I can just see what's on this guy, can't I? Hmm. It's because my lips are already frowny. I, I'm not going to change my eyes either. Eyebrows I might change. Connor's eyebrows are definitely right. But where's his freckles? Like this Connor has no freckles. Connor's got like freckles. My Connor is so pretty. <laughs> I might take the eyeliner off. <laughs> I made him too pretty. I can't help it. Connor eyes were there, but I don't. Oh yeah, yeah, no. I like my pretty soulful eyes more. Oh my gosh, the LED! No, I don't have the LED. Oh, but I, how did I miss that? Sims for Connor Detroit LED. How did I forget that? What an Egypt. Um, CC included. Okay, amazing. Oh my gosh, I have like, I can download like nine LEDs. Right, give me a hot sec. Hair, brows, everything. Oh my gosh. Okay, give me a sec, guys. You're gonna like this. I'm gonna have to restart my game again, by the way. Because <laughs> I can't stop taking this really seriously. Connor sliders. Enhanced butt sliders. Why don't I... 
Why don't I have more sliders? And then tray files. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna add this version as well. This is by Lady Spira. And we can do a little compare and contrast. Okay. You guys, we're taking this really seriously. Right, I have to just restart my game again. <laughs> Enhanced butt sliders. Imagine just being able to apply those in real life. It would like oh, I'm gonna have a bigger butt today. I'm just gonna just gonna download my enhanced butt sliders. Butt sliders are essential. <laughs> let the audience see. Oh yeah, sorry guys. Let me um, let me actually let my game get my game booting in the background because it takes twelve and a half thousand years. Uh, this is the one that I've downloaded. Connor Sim. Oops, game loading. Um, and then this was the pack, the CC pack, and then like look how much comes with it. It has so much like hair and accessories, enhanced butt sliders. Are you even living if you've not downloaded enhanced butt sliders? Yeah, everyone's forgotten his freckles. I agree. This is using the Obscura skin again, that's why. I don't get why it, people are erasing his beautiful freckles, you know? Keep the freckles. The freckles are so cute. You have no idea Connor had an enhanced butt. Maybe all androids do. Maybe it's like an android feature. <gasps> the ones where Red loved actually light up in cast. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Titan, thank you so much for nine months in a row. with Twitch baby. Thank you. How are we doing? We're on 59 new peaches today. Thank you. I'm making your obsession worse. Like, I feel like I'm making all of our obsessions worse. I'm Hakana <laughs> with the insta booty. Yeah, freckles are cute. <laughs> it was one of the upgrades that came with RK800. Exactly. What are you guys having for dinner tonight? Um, Firo, I have a, C a, C a CC series on where I got like hair and um skin CC from. So if you CC from, so if you go on my YouTube, you'll be able to find the series. It's called the, the CC series or something. Um, what was I talking about? I got distracted by. What did I get distracted by? Enhanced splits. Oh yeah, what are you guys having for dinner? What is egg in the hole? <laughs> Why does that sound so wrong? Uh, is it like toad in the hole but with an egg? Extreme vampire woo woos. Um, where is this new one? You still having pizza, fried clams? Wow. Oh wait. Um. Oh, this is the Lady Spiro one. I don't know. I don't feel like any of them have like encapsulated Connor for me. Maybe this is how I see Connor. So none of the others are gonna like work for me. That one lost their eyebrows, which is weird because I definitely added everything. Side profile's good. See, I think that one's better. I think that one's pretty good, actually. Yeah, that side profile's good, isn't it? Mine is the epitome of a Clash of On Sim. This is the problem. It, it so clearly looks like I made it. I've realized my lip color no longer matches my skin color. Yeah, that's better. Um, my Sims always have a similar look, and this one is no exception. Okay, these are the Connor eyebrows. Oh my gosh! Right, I've got it. I've got to figure out a way to make these work because these are definitely his eyebrows. Like they're the eyebrows, right? I took the saturation filters off, but I still have, there we go. Oh my gosh, I can't, how, how do people play without filters on? That's the actual game. It's so devoid of color. I would pick this version every single time. Yeah, these are definitely his eyebrows. 
He does have quite... I think he's got quite thin eyebrows. Man, I wish my eyebrow thickness filter was working. Because I really want to make him a bit thicker. Does he look too sad? What shaders do I use? I use <coughs> Brights. Sorry, Guy by Gaburu. It's called the Bright Shader. I add on uh, DPX, which I actually might take off. Uh, vibrance, just a touch, just a touch. Colorfulness, because um, that's the difference. It's colorfulness that adds it. Magic Bloom, just a little touch. And a tone map. DPX I probably don't need, but hey ho, I probably have it on for a reason. That I think that's Connor. There's still something very. Oh wait, it's his widow's peak. Where did where does his widow's peak live? Problem is I don't know where it is. This Connor's got it, but it's the hair itself. This Connor doesn't have it either. Where the hell is this Widow's Peak at? Connor. I don't think that's quite right. But it's probably closer. I think his, his nostrils are a little bit more visible than that. Like that. I think that's closer. Yeah, that nose is good, right? Sorry, I know this is like literally the preset, but I'm still going to make it my own. <laughs> is there a Connor lips? Nah, no lip preset. Sag. Any more Connor presets? Nah. Where is the Widow's Peak at? Look up Connor's voice actor. I want to stick to in-game Connor. Plus, I, his voice actor is very smiley. But Connor doesn't actually smile, so it's not very helpful. It's the eyes. The eyes are not it. Okay. Is there a Connor eye preset? God damn it. They need to be closer together. Oh, he looks just so sad. Stop looking so sad, Connor. They're not as big and a lot more narrow. Let me show you guys the eyes again. So I tried to do that shape. Like that. Yeah, I can't do the eye bags. I don't have enough layers. I literally can't do them. It's the color, okay. I am just trying to do like my favorite eye shape, which my uh, eye color, which is probably not the best way to do it. I thought, see, this is the obscurest kind of eyes, but I just, I like more realistic eyes than that. They were pretty good, but I actually think the first ones we tried were pretty good. Let's see what other eyes I got. They could work. He looks too lifelike. His eyes are more dead looking. Maybe more downturned.
I'm putting his eye shape like this to try and show that his eye bug's going over. I've made him look less like him now. Like, I think he looks less like him. I was happier with him a while ago. I think I've gone too far. I, I, float, I flew too close to the sun. His eye is really tiny now. There. It's perfect. He looks like he wants to eat a dandelion. <laughs> I don't know if his eyes are now too close together. Maybe that... I don't know. He's kind of turning more into like Dean Winchester or something. Yeah, his eyes are small. I always forget how small men's eyes are. Looks so freaking sad. The monster squid. Where is his widow's peak? I feel like without the widow's peak, he's never going to look right. Like no matter what I do... He's always going to look wrong. But I, I don't have a widow's peak. Which is what's so weird because I felt like I downloaded like 12 of them. I know I'm just like literally taking it too far. Maybe in tattoos. That's what, oh, wait a minute. What's that taking off? Oh, nothing. Of great concern. Oh, that adds the... Oh, it adds here. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's a bit Widow's Peaky. It doesn't go deep enough. But it gives him for some... It gives him these lines. Okay, let me check tattoos. I don't think he's balding. Some men's hairlines are just naturally like that, but then they don't advance. They'll stay at that level for like um, uh -huh. all time, you know? That's just where they are meant to be. Oh, I'm going to partially Ooh. check myself. Tell me if you see any Connors in here. So I should give him a little, a little ah. dog nose. He does like sumo. Ooh. He can't bald, he's a robot. True. Robots can't. Huh. These are good. We like these. Yeah, I can't see any widow's peaks. That's literally making me so freaking angry. Oh! <gasps> Connor hairline. Okay, I need a hair then that starts further back. Because this is the Connor hairline, like, literally right here. The hairline is right! I need hair that starts further back, that's the problem. The actual- the Con his voice is a bit high, but I think Connor's voice is quite high. I think so anyway. He has a wider forehead. Yeah, it does. It goes up deeper than this, I would say. Let me make sure I'm not over overlaying it with another one. There we go. That's the right hairline. Imagine how creeped out the actor who streams would be if he came on the stream now. He'd be like, oh my god. This is actually horrifying. Of course, all the hairs are going to start too far forward. 
I'm, I, I don't think I'm going to be able to get a hairline that sits far back enough. <laughs> Jesus freaking Christ. Yeah, his voice is high and hoarse. Who did that? Who just jump scared me? Oh my gosh. Anonymous! Who anonymously just jump scared me? That scared the hell out of me. Whew. That fully freaked me out. Tina, was that you? Oh my gosh, you actually got me so good. Well done. This hair looks actually gross on him. Makes me want to throw up. What about if I do that? Oh, it's wings. So of course, all the hair colors are awful. Oh my gosh, if this hair color was right, it I would literally have nailed it. How do I not be cursing? <laughs> if that hair color was darker, we would literally have nailed it. Like... I might just go for it anyway. Give my boy some highlights. Why the hell not? Because look. Sorry, I'm just like looking at that again and seeing some bits that I think are wrong. Wider brow. Oh, it's not dark. Try the one to the right. It's lighter. I would literally have to recolor it myself, which I just really can't be asked to do. That's the best we're gonna get. I might just have to do black. Change the hairline color. <laughs> oh wait so it blends in more with that other hair oh, it's so light it's way too light i know it is but look that is literally perfect look and then Yeah, the highlights are so annoying. The, the highlights are literally just stressing me out. But Wings hair just never has the right colors. Ever. Wing, like, you always need a recolor with Wings. Great hairs, awful swatches. I'm going on record saying that. Yeah, that hair streak coming down is so perfect. Let's just go for that. This is wrong, so let me just change that. And then I'll add his LED and then we're done. Yeah, the hair streak coming down is perfect. If I recolored it, I could really get it close. But... I... Ain't nobody got time for that. I was trying to make up some legit excuse as to why I couldn't do it, but... God, honest truth is I just can't be asked. So, at least we're all on the same page. Why are none of these colors right? No, I'm just gonna have to do it quite dark, aren't I? Okay, Connor now has black hair. So, looks good, right? Right, where is the LED? Also, I downloaded some new rig outs and I just wanna see if I can find them real quick. Ooh. Also, I feel like I say that word and you guys never question it, but rig out is outfit in Claire speak. So if you're ever wondering what rig out means, I'm talking about an outfit. I don't know if it's an Irish thing or if it's um, a Northern thing, but it means, it means outfit. You say rig out. What is it? Where is it from? <laughs> I wish his eyebrows were a bit darker, like a bit more in between. Oh, that one's better. Look at this, before. After. 
Yeah, I think that one's better. Ah. I thought his um, rig out said Connor on it. Maybe I just imagined that though. For some reason, I thought it said Connor. I wonder if it came with any trousers. I'm gonna have Sims walking around dressed as this now. You do realize that. No, I don't think I do. And I kind of want to give him the shoes that other one had because they covered more of his socks. Everyone knows socks are just annoying. Daddy boots. Because he's our daddy. Hmm. You think it's a, a military thing? Hmm. Hmm. Yes, I am posting it on YouTube. I'm Marlin, Don't worry. Yeah, it says Android. I thought, yeah, they are big stompers, aren't they? Um, I thought it said Connor on the back of it. Right, where are these LEDs hiding out? Tell me if you see an LED. Why don't we just give him these? Do you not remember Connor having those? I do. He, I think he also had these. And... Oh! <gasps> Oh, it's in his hair. Oh no. It's in his hair a little bit. I like the yellow one like he's thinking. But I guess this one's like such a... Raise his eyebrows and eyes higher. Like that. I did something wrong. I broke something. I really like his side profile now. I'm just gonna make his eyebrows less emotional, a bit flatter. What do you reckon? Oh, his teeth is. I've given him the blue LED just because it's very um, iconic. <laughs> uh, my most realistic teeth are probably the, ooh. These ones, but I'm thinking no. I don't know, I think sometimes realistic teeth can look a bit weird. Yeah, I think his face is closer together than that. I also definitely think his eyes are... I can't go any closer. I can't make his eyes any closer together. I don't know. I think that's pretty good. Why did it do that? I think that's pretty good. I think he's as good as we're gonna get him. His forehead is too long. Oh, we, you know what we could do? We could measure out his face. We could measure out his face. Okay, so if I sit back in my chair and don't let my chair move, and then, um, so, from his widow's peak to his eyebrow is like one nail to knuckle. Next nail to knuckle goes to the bottom of his nose. Next nail to knuckle goes just before the end of his chin. Did you ever do this in art at school? Like use your th like thumb to measure. So let me go back far enough so I can get nail to knuckle. Wait, I need to, there we go. Nail to knuckle. No, that's right. His chin's not low enough though. 
The scale would be the same. He's a bit at a side angle as well. Glad I just get a ruler. What's wrong with my nail to knuckle approach? Yeah, his chin isn't long enough. I agree. His face was too short. But I thought his shortness was wrong here. But it's actually here, believe it or not. His eyes are too big. If I put him at a side, I wish you could make him look at the camera from a side angle because then I could get the exact same shot. Not quite right, but it's kind of close. The eyes are too small. What, I need to make them bigger? Like that? Oh yeah, his eyebrows are way further apart. How did I not notice that? This sounds really weird, but I think I've made him look more like his wife. <laughs> How have I done that? <laughs> I can't make his eyes any closer together. Look, we're at max. Like, I have, right? The, it looks more like the actress that is his wife in real life. How have I done that? I don't know how I've done <laughs> I don't know how I've done that, but I have. It's... It's something I've done, but... <laughs> I don't know how, but I have. His eyebrows are more flat and less slanted. How do I do that, though? I have so much trouble with eyebrows. I've made him, like, I've made his eyes really feminine. I, I didn't try out the butt slide. What is extreme butt slider? That's, oh, oh, is it because I can do that? I need some, a little pardon, you know? Um, yeah, but his, his hair's curly in real life, but not in the game. I still prefer my version, but there's definitely something wrong with my version and I just can't, I can't figure out what it is. I like need to almost like overlay them. The bottom eyelashes, eyelashes are too noticeable. Okay. I think also the, maybe the eyelid is too much. Now nah, that looks weird, right? You've got to have an eyelid. Light color for purple. I think we're, no, we're not on purple. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Light color's purple, there we go. His top lip's too large. I've got some more subtle eyelashes. And um, this song, I'm sorry, is just really annoying me. Whereas the song's an absolute banger. Um. <laughs> Maybe like that, a bit more subtle. Okay, I'm glad you've just joined and you've said that, Peachy. It's getting closer. He's had a lash lift. You think he looks perfect. Okay, let me just save him. Um, I'm just going to get rid of these two for a sec because they're not mine. I was just using them as a reference. That, that, no, I, I still, I, I like mine the best. Um, he's still not right, but I think he's closer. But I'm gonna make the evil version of him. Real Connor looks mean while he looks sad. Well, no, so I'm gonna do now 
Uh, machine Connor. So I'm gonna make it red. I, I can't really remember what red stands for. Is red deviant? Like, I can't even remember, to be honest. Um, and I kind of just want, like, I don't know if it's a change the eyebrows. I know I'm being so annoying, but I think my issue is my eyebrows. I think the eyebrows are too sparse. <laughs> Why are they so spooky? I don't know. Red is deviant. Or red is trauma. It just makes him look mean though, right? And I, what I'd love to do is make him smile, but just on like one side of his mouth. Oh, I can do that with mouth corners. Like he's kind of enjoying... Mind you, machine corner don't really enjoy anything, but it just makes him look mean, all right? If I like make him smirk a little bit. Um, and then machine corner also always be shooting folks. So I feel like he would have like a little... A little blood splatter on his face. I think that one's better, actually. Yeah, this is Machine Connor. You're looking all mean and angry. Oh, it would be blue blood. No, but it's not his blood. It's not his blood. He's been shooting humans. <laughs> I don't know why he's been doing that. Um, I don't have a blue blood one. I could just do it as marks instead. Yeah, maybe I just do it as marks instead. He didn't go after, no, he didn't go after the humans. I'll just make him look a bit banged up, you know? Um... And I, I kind of, I wish I could just drag one corner of his mouth up. That's as sad as I can make him. Machine corner. And then I want to do one more thing. Um... I want to do, <laughs> I want to do, wait, where's mine? Is this mine? Yeah. Hmm. I want to do them with these little human clovies on. Yeah, Machine Connor is on the human side. Okay, so this is Sweet Connor again. Then let me give him his little heart. Oh my gosh, it's heart seven, I need to eat soon. Um, I do have a long beanie. But I think it's tied to a hair. But it's fine because you can't actually see his hair when he's in this mode. Yeah, it's here. <laughs> I was mentally so not prepared for human clothes, Connor. He looks angry with his human clothes on, look. <laughs> yeah, I was just not ready for that at all. Um, so I'm gonna make him a bit he kind of looks mad when he's pretending to be human I don't know why something about humans just really annoys him babe same and then he's got like a big old coat on let's find him a big old coat where's my coat at I know which coat I want but I can't find it it's giving Jake from the main series. <laughs> Don't. Hmm. <laughs> Is this the closest I'm gonna get? I'm gonna put a scarf on him. Yeah, let me put a little scarf on now. It's giving me Nathan. <laughs> it wasn't as high as that. Maybe there. Just 
Yes. You remember when he raided Jericho in Off-White? Does anyone remember that? I do. I don't I think his skin tone's still not right, but I'm also really not used to not having bright red sims. So that's him without the skin tone changes. Stop doing that cute face. You're meant to be angry. There. Okay, so in conclusion. Regular Connor. Should I make him do some like Connor poses? Yes. There. Connor poses. But he's like happy Connor. <laughs> Wait, can I make him wink? I don't think I've got any winky faces. These are, okay, th these ones are probably best for um, nice deviant Connor. Hi, Hank. I need him going. <laughs> and then let me put his trait back. And then we've got deviant Connor. No, machine Connor. Hmm. Who I feel like needs um, these poses. He's angry, man. He's about to go all... Yeah, he's going to slap you. You're going to get slapped. Like, I don't know what he's going to do to you, though. He's probably going to pull your eyes out. Put him into a little pie. Cook it at 180 degrees for 45 minutes. Can I make him lick his fingers? I don't think I can. <laughs> That would be the perfect pose, wouldn't it? And then, um, pretending to be human, Connor. <laughs> to be fair, humans do do a lot of that. Um, look how human I am. Here I am with my human emotions. Um, look, I'm so emotional and human right now. I don't want to eat your eye pie. That's what he's saying. He's getting really into being human. <laughs> All it took was the Sims. He needed Detroit become human Sims. I love it so much. Which, okay, let's do a quick little poll before we end. Um, I want to know which was your favorite. Fave, Connor. Uh, human. Wait, no, sorry. I'll do it in order so it's easier. Deviant. Machine. Or human. Let me know which one you guys like best. Magdalena! Magdalena, thank you so much for the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, a thousand bits! Thank you, I'm glad you like him. Uh, Morales, thank you so much for subscribing with your Prime. And also Jupiter Jaws, thank you so much for subscribing as well. Can we welcome both of them to the Peaches, please? I kind of want to get a screenshot of all of them in their like key poses. So let's do one of this. No, no, no. No, you do this one again. That is perfect for Machine Connor. And then for Human Connor. Um, what's the best one for Human Connor? I need, where's an eye lick? Can you please, uh, not an eye lick. <laughs> can you, can you lick your fingers? Can I, f oh, he's just so, so stressed. Man, life is stressful. Yes, he's licking his finger. <laughs> you guys like deviant corner the most 54% yeah, don't lick your eye yes that one there do that one again we've switched for some reason to like um he's licking with his thumb now yeah don't do an eye lick that's disgusting that's kind of a finger lick but it's not concentrating enough you like his downturned eyebrows. It's quite unusual, isn't it? You don't see it very often in people. Right, do your thumb lick. There you go. Wow, he's he's look he. It's just a bit much, right? Making us all feel a certain type of way. Oh, look, you can't contemplate in the case. The case is a tough one. I've not found the right pose for this one yet. I have so many poses. This is how I make thumbnails. So I've got like 12 million of them. Do a little smile. 
There, that's probably a good one for him. And then <laughs> this is my favorite one because it's just like full on wreck, Connor. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's just amusing me. There we go! You guys like this version best. I like it with more color, but I need so much saturation just to make me engage with a game. It's just ridiculous. One of those poses look like a finger lick too. Wait, which one, which one? Yeah, cast poses, I can't make thumbnails without them. I have to keep swapping them out all the time too. What does Aki oh, think? He's not bothered. It's a video. It's it's like if it was a real person, I think he'd be a bit concerned. And I know technically it is, but it, it's not. It's a video game character, isn't it? That you one you just moved using a hollow on human Connor. What did I use on him? Did I use that one? Yeah, that one. Actually, that's got loads of them, hasn't it? That's goofball. Do the thing, Connor. Do the thing. If anything, there wasn't enough of that, I thought. There could have been much more. So many of those look like they could be little licks. How about you react to it? It is more accurate without the color filters, but I would say that is less like strictly my game being too colorful and more the color palette of Detroit Become Human being very low saturation slash blue. Trying to give myself a good out here. <laughs> I like saturation. I like it a lot. Okay, guys, I am going to leave it there because I'm going to go get some dindins. It's either spug bowl tonight or curry. Both are, as you can imagine, absolutely fantastic options. So I am very excited about both. Yeah, the game is quite um, desaturated, isn't it? It, it? it suits the color perfectly. Um, you guys want me to upload this to gallery? I am gonna warn you guys that it's not gonna look um because I'm obsessed. It's a sickness. Um Deviant I'll upload this to the gallery. It's not gonna look like this in your game though, because don't forget the skin details basically saved us. So, you know. Um, but if you have all the same CC as me, it should be helpful. And uh, you guys will have to let me know what you think. I'm gonna mm. upload it to the gallery. There we go. Wait, no, I didn't do better poses. I'm so annoying for that. Oh wait, I can't. Why can't I change the poses? Hmm. Hmm. Weird. Annoying. Yeah, it won't let me. <laughs> yeah, look at you guys, cute heads. Huh. Yeah, I can't change the poses. Um, but right, we're gonna raid Gid today, so please give Gid all of the love. Um, have a beautiful evening, guys. Have a really nice um weekend as well. Also, don't forget that there should let me just double check, there should be a new episode of Wolfies, Sims 4 Werewolves, that has gone up on my main channel. Yes, it has. So please go and share um all of the love with that as well. And I will see you guys on Monday. And we're gonna be playing the quarry next week, don't forget. There is a link to the new video. Goodbye!